Okay, class. My request to everyone to please stand. And Mr. Roderick Arjo, will you please uh, lead the prayer? Okay, let's bow our head and feel the presence of God. Dear God, we praise you and we thank you for this wonderful day. Grant us the degrees to understand our lesson for today through whatever media or modality may it be. And bless us so that we may appreciate this grace of being able to study, despite of the challenges that we are facing because of this pandemic. Make us realize that the value of education and the beauty of learning so that each day we will be more motiva motivated to do our responsibilities as a student. Bless our classmates that they too may see your good goodness in everything and see this time as an opportunity to show our love to our parents by studying well. Bless our teachers so that they will become more inspired to teach us and see this time as an opportunity to show compassion in their chosen profession. And lastly, our parents so that they may become resilient especially during the, these trying times. We humbly ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Thank you, Mr. Rodrigo Arjo. Good morning, class. I am John Paolo Recio, and I will be your teacher for today. Who is our class secretary? I am the class secretary, sir. Mr. Renyar de Lohans, right? Yes, sir. Is there any absent for today? None, sir. Very good. Okay, class, uh, before we proceed to our new topic, we have activity. If you have a 20 pesos in your pocket at bumili ka ng halagang 8 pesos, magkano sa kulimo? Um, Raise your hand. Uh, sir, Mark, ang gina yung what? Uh, 12. Correct. And next, binigyan ka ng 10 pesos ng nanay mo at binigyan ko ulit ng 20 pesos ng tito mo. Magkano lahat ang nakakapunta sa'yo? Sir. Marjorie? 30, sir. Correct. Thank you, Marjorie. Listen, class. Our topic is all about operation on integers in algebra. Uh, do you have any idea about integers, class? Sir, we don't have any idea. That's okay. A little bit, sir. And now I will discuss the operation on integers para mong nawa nyo ay guys class do you have any idea about integers we don't have any idea sir a little bit sir sige kapanawa nyo para may hindi nyo class thank you sir integers is set from negative numbers to positive numbers from the definition of integers Will you give uh, some of some of examples? Adam, negative five. Correct. Other uh, no hand. Mark Angelo, what? Positive five. Okay. Ah, uh, guys, what's the number of integers? Um. Bernadette. Based on the definition, sir, uh -huh. na sinabi na from negative numbers to positive positive numbers, so it is. Yung zero po ay included sa negative numbers. Very good. Thank you so much. Our topic in algebra is about operation on integers. Operation on integers is adding negative and positive numbers. And this is line number. Nagamit ako ng line number para mas lalo nyo kung may tindihan kung paano mag-solve ng operation on integers. And I will give an example. Adding 4 
plus positive 3. Pag gumamit ka sa, pag ginamit mo ang line number, mag move ka, alright. 1, 2, 3. Dung pa sa point na yan. Ay, mali pa. Then I will give an example, gamit ang line number, para mas maunawaan yung gamitin ito. Mas mahirap kasi, kung mga kakabsaduhin nyo lang, yung formula. Mas mainam kung alam nyo at naunawaan nyo. I-visualize niyo yung line number para madali nyo lang masagutan yung mga problems, mga operations. At ito guys, adding 3 plus 2 gamit ang line number. Pag mo na tayo pa kanan ng 3, 1, 2, 3, at plus 2, positive. Alam nyo na naman yun. Pagka positive, add yun. At mag tayo ng dalawa. 1, 2, 3. At sa point na yun, doon tayo yung ito. 5. Kaya ang sagot ay 5. Positive 5. Plus, para mas masagutan yun na mas madali, ang mga operations, kailangan alam niyo yung rules for addition. Positive plus positive equals positive. Positive plus negative, depende. Depende sa number kung ano mas malaki. Kung ano mas malaki number, yun na susundan natin na sign. And the negative plus positive, ganun pa din. Kung ano mas malaki number, yun na susundan. And last, ne negative plus negative equals negative. Hindi siya magbabago ng sign. Negative na plus. And next operation is subtraction. Mas maganda rin na mas malaman nyo yung rules for subtraction para mas ma masagutan nyo na mas maayos. Mas maayos. Huwag kang masyadong... And next is uh, operation for subtraction. Ito ang rules for subtraction. Positive minus positive. Depende. Depende kung ano sa malaking number. Gaya din sa addition. Depende lang din. Next is positive minus negative. Positive minus negative equals positive. Negative minus positive equals negative. The negative minus negative depende pa rin sa number, kung ano yung mas malaking number. Give example for rule number 1 using line number. Positive minus positive. Okay. 3, positive 3 minus positive 2. Pagka positive, going right lang tayo. Gagawin tayo ng 3. 1, 2, 3. Minus 2. Pagka minus, gawin pa kaliwa. Move pa kaliwa. 1, 2. Hindi tayo sa point na pangalawa. Bale sa good noon, 1. Positive 1. And next na rule naman, yung pangalawa. Positive minus negative. Positive 3 minus negative 2. Dito natin gagamitin yung rule for subtraction sa sign. Negative times negative may yung positive. Balik lang din yung gagawin natin nun. Move tayo pa kanan. 1, 2, 3. Plus 2, 1, 2. Same 2 sa 5. Ang sagot nun ay positive 5. Okay? Pangatlo naman. At sa huling rule naman, negative minus negative. Negative 3 minus negative 2. Negative times negative equals positive. Negative 3 Move tayo pa kanan. Count tayo ng 3. 1, 2, 3. Doon tayo hindi sa pinagalan natin. Negative 3. Pag naman positive 2, move tayo pa kaliwa. Pabalik tayo pa kaliwa. Move tayo ng 2. 1, 2. Kung saan tayo ng ito, yun ang sagot. Balik ang sagot, negative 1. Yun ang rule for subtraction.
since na-discuss ko na yung operation on integers, at ikin din yun na naman. Uh, prepare na nga na one half sheet of paper at nasagutan ko. Bibigyan ko kayo ng 20 minutes. Pagkatapos nun, bibigyan ko assignment at ipapasa sa Monday. Okay class, thank you. And that's all for today. Thank you and see you around. <laughs>